So in this recording, I'm gonna talk about the boomerang and the panorama and how we use them in these inquiry sessions. So the boomerang and the panorama are used to see how we identify ourselves in relationship, in relationship to other people, to events, could be world events, it could be in situations that have happened to us, could be coworkers, just whenever there's a trigger, there's a relationship to something that's happening externally. And so we end up, what we're really looking for is what is our deficiency story, right? And so we all have deficiency stories. We might feel like we're not good enough or we're broken or we're not safe or we're a victim um, can, or un unlovable. There's just an endless number of deficiency stories that we have. And those are unconscious stories that are running the show and they're running our lives. So when we get triggered by something outside of us, we may project onto that person or onto the situation or the event, like that shouldn't be happening. They shouldn't be like that. They're a jerk, whatever it is that we're projecting outward. But in the boomerang, what we're doing is we're, we're bringing that back to us. We're looking for what is the belief we have about ourselves in relation to this? So we're trying to get to the real belief, the, the real identity. Who do I really believe that I am in this situation? We're trying to get to the core of that, the root of you know, what's really going on, what's the real story here. So for example, I could be triggered by, um, let's say it was to say a coworker, for example, and maybe they did something that triggers me and I might say, oh, they shouldn't have done that, or they're a jerk, or you know, whatever the whatever the story is that we, we start projecting out. But if we really look at them, if we hold an image of them up in front of us and we feel that we're having a reaction in the body, the boomerang is when we look at that person or the situation, we ask ourselves, what does it mean about me? Okay, so it's not shadow work, it's not you spot it, you got it. It's not like they're critical, that means I'm critical, which may be the case, but really we're looking for how am I identified in this situation? So for me, it's typically I'm not good enough. That's my core story. So any number of things might trigger that, that identity. So we, or I don't matter or something like that. Um, but we look at the person or the situation and we ask, what does it mean about me? and we wait for the answer to rise. It's usually an I am statement. So we're really looking for that because often what can come up when we're starting to do the boomerang is we might have more story around it, how things should be different or something different should have happened. Um, we're looking for like, who do I believe that I am in this case? Am I, I'm not safe, I'm not good enough, I'm unworthy, whatever the situation is, whatever the belief is. And we start the inquiry from there. It's, it's, it's one way we often start inquiry sessions. We don't have to start that way, but it's one way that we can get to the root. What's really going on is I believe that I'm not good enough or I don't matter or I'm a victim. And then we can bring that into inquiry. So the difference between the boomerang and the panorama is the boomerang is we're looking at one person or one situation where we're triggered. In the panorama, we're looking at multiple, so more than one it's really the same process. So I might be triggered by you know, everyone at work, or I might be triggered by my whole family, or I might be triggered by you know, specific world events, a whole you know, political party, I might be triggered by that. So we can put that out kind of in a circle around us, just visualizing the people or the events around us from always from resting, watching that, notice that there's a reaction in the body and asking, what does it mean about me? That's the question, that's what I wanna know. We're turning it back inward. What does it mean about me? So boomerang, one person or event, panorama, more than one, so multiple. And that's the boomerang and panorama.